This must be snotting out. Saxon and Dane live in peace. I expected nothing less for land under Hemingway Yarl's rule. See Billy again. Come to Snottingham. Let's go. It's tricky to be Make sure the supplies are secure. We may set off at any moment. I trust my own eyes? Is that truly who I see? Trygvi, you old hound. How are you? Eivor, a friend of old is a good omen. Look at this. Your chin grass might be mistaken for hedges now. Ah, but a healthy Jarl beard it is not. And what of Billy? I was happy to get his message. I stand in Billy's place today. He and his father have gone to Ulkathorpe to stave off an invasion of Picts. We've laid a long siege, and Hemingryal looks to finish the job. I have not fought beside Billy and his father since we were young. They have my blade if they need it. In spite of these war cries, you should know that Vili's father is more frail than last you saw him. How could that be? Hemming a Jarl is an ox. So he is. And he'll be pleased a skull with the moon in his jaws at the sight of you. Come. The swiftest path is by river. But these waters are hostile to Norsemen. You bring good luck with you. We could guide the sail steeds downstream. I'm ready for whatever danger awaits. Prepare your convoy, and we'll be off. Our Jarl has waited long enough. We follow the Wolfkist to the encampment. Traveled far, spilling the dew of slaughter. A reputation is the price of victory. Aha! Indeed!
Freddy the Sea Beasts. Eivor Wolfkist is here to escort us upriver. I remember when Billy and I were small children. You spun many epic yarns for us over the hearth's fire. But I do not remember you telling us how you came to serve Heminga Yarn. Is it a tale worth telling? It is, but a sad one. I suppose I was the age you are now. Skadi had sent us a harsh winter and much of our clan was starving. To feed us, my family incurred a large word debt. But my youth rendered me too proud hey! to pay it off. I wanted to raid, not to oh! For my failure, Heming Yao could have taken what he wanted from my family, including our lives. But his heart is kind. He spared us, and I pledged myself to him. Gladly so. Ready. So Fire! it has ever been. Pick to shore! Protect the convoy! Run up the sail! Green. Green sail! Fire! Fire! Ready? Fire! The convoy remains, Wolfkist! The convoy is unscathed. Hemingagar will be pleased. the ship here. Sí. 
I have orders to go to Stoneberg, but our camp is just ahead, so hurry on without me. Vili and Hemminger Jarl will be pleased to see you. Your son sent for me, Hemingya Jarl. One of the happier messages I've had in England. I wish I could expand on this happiness with good news. But we are in the center of a storm. And yet, my old heart sings great songs at the sight of you. You look good, Eifur. Strong. Healthy. My heart sings as well. It's good to see you again. Hey, uh, yours is a poet's heart, I am told. What a mix of spirits you have. Movement on the walls! We must end this soon. Before the weather changes. The whole of my clan would be here if you called them. No need. These men are flies for swatting. Even now, Drakefi rides for Stoneberg, should any Picts escape. It will all be ended by this time tomorrow. You have known me as your Jarl for an age. And I have known and loved you all since you were babes. An easy burden to bear. Let's hope you fight better than you age, old friend. You're not slurring, Willy. Have you mislaid your ale? Today, you do not fight for me. Not for each other. Today, you fight for your children. Fight so that they may grow. So they may be good and just as you are. For them, today, we take back Ulkerthorp. Trigvi and Eivor have brought us arrows and oil to bring firelight to the Picts. To feed their traps. The first to signal from the top of that tower, their war chief's weapon in hand, drinks my mead for the month. Thor's beard. It's good to see you, Vili. Oh, is it? Or have you come to snatch glory from my callous hands? We can snatch glory together. Unless you're too frightened to fight beside me. Oh no, this is a contest now. To the top of that tower, and the pig chief is the prize. Old times, then. And new alike. Fight, Heminger sons! Bring victory today! For tomorrow, we feast! Like the arrows! May they burn with flame unbridled! The pig chief hides by... Show me what lies ahead. Like a cow. No doubt. 
Guards here are vigilant. Look for him on high ground. I will have his head for him and Gayal. Billion is Have his head for him and Gayal. Have his head for him and Gayal.
I'll finish you!
going to feed the
side.
Father's meat. You're injured. No, no, stop, stop. I am fine. There is more blood here than injury. Pride cannot heal you, Heminger. Only care and bandages. My clan fought well, did they not? You saw it. The heart in these people. How they rallied behind their Jarl. You have that effect on men. They trust you. <coughs> and they love my son all the more. But he lacks the trust of our Thanes. And I am running out of time to persuade them. You are sick. And you accept it. Unlike my son, he thinks me immortal because he must. He does not want what I have to give him. Was it Billy who summoned me, or you, Heminger? I thought you would come faster if it was Billy's name you heard first. I need your wisdom, Mayfor. Your discretion. You have it. Of course. There will be a thing soon, in which the nobles must name a new Jarl. And I am torn. I would have my son follow in my steps, but he is reluctant. He follows his warrior's heart. Others will name Trigvi, a fine man with a mind for leadership, but his lineage is tattered, and he is less bold. I have known Billy since we were small. He's bold and courageous, and your warriors love the man. The nobles should choose him. Your sight is clear and your mind is sharp. Let that guide your thinking in the days to come. Philly departs for kinder downfall soon. Right with him. And talk like old friends made new. If I see any Valkyries lurking nearby, I will send them away. I can fight them off a while longer.
soon and guide me. Billy. There you are. Come. Ride with me to the falls. They are Freya's gifts to these unforgiving lands. All right. But if I don't find another side of them, you've oversold the view. You fight with impressive skill, I should say. I taught you well, I think. You <laughs> taught me how to fight empty air, Billy, and trees and snowdrift and the like. No, I am certain I saved you from a snowdrift once, and a murderous tree. That's how I remember it. Any man who would call a tree murderous is a man who's had one too many blows to the head. That tower there, it recalls the broken wall in Norway on the road to my uncle's. Remember? I do. I remember the bite of that winter's chill as we sheltered from the wind for hours. It was you who got us stuck there. Searching for the chickens you let loose before the Yule Feast. I'll have you remember. It's good to ride with you again, Narstick. I told you, that was meant to be a dragon's tail. It was a woody little twig in my eyes. No dragon's tail. Must I remind you of your own disrobed adventures in the pre-dawn streets of Starvenger? Eivor the Pantless, a head soaked with mead, and many pockets full of vomit. A dragon's tail it was, then. Are you sure you want my father's mead? Not afraid you might wake up tomorrow, naked, face down in a hog's pen? Is that what you call your house? Ah! <laughs> Stoneber, was Trigvi not sent there by father to help? We must go. I came too late to stop this. The Picts set fires and ran. They mean to spite us. There are more people trapped within. Free them, Eivor. Tend the wounded. We'll get them out. Leave your 
things. Get to Trickley. You'll be safe with him. Over here. Move. Move. Get to safety. Billy, where are you? Billy, where are you? Billy, where are you? Answer me.
to clear a path. I will get the man, Eivor. You carry the woman. Nifelheim will have to wait. You are staying here today. <coughs> oh, thank thee, all father. Hold on to me. I can get you out. I thought I might have to rescue you, Willy. Had I died, it would have been my time. My fate is already spun. I'm sorry, but you cannot endanger yourselves like this, lords. You have people to lead, a future to consider. The old man has wisdom, Willy. You have the full weight of this clan on your back. My father carries that weight. I do the fighting and feasting, and I am expert at both. Good to have you watching my back again, Eivor. You see what I deal with, Eivor? The mind of a troll in the body of an Aesir. <laughs> Still the same ass stick as when we were children. I'll never change. This is hardly the time for lightness, you two. We have many injured to comfort. Well, that is your domain, Trigvi. I don't wish to be seen as a savior and healer all in one afternoon. The waters at Kinderdunfall will soothe my wounds. If my father needs me, I'll be there. Billy, stop! Eivor, wait a moment. Heminger Jarl has confided in you about his health. He has. He said Billy wasn't taking it well. Billy lives in another world entirely right now. He is cracked inside. ...and will not face the full truth laid before him. And how are you? Have you braced yourself for what is to come? I... I have made my peace with the future. Yes. Worry yourself with the wounded here. I will talk to Willy myself. Is beautiful. Now, where is he? Stretch your wings, Sunan. 